So when, when you're eating the bagel, bagel tomorrow for breakfast, this is how the wheat will break down. So I'm, we're going to go down the left cascade first, OK? First of all, it breaks down into a protein, which is gluten. And the gluten breaks down into gliadins. And gliadins are basically just the protein that makes up gluten. Now, gliadins have four ep epitopes, which is alpha, beta, gamma, and omega. Now, traditional testing only looks at alpha gliadin. Now, here's the thing. You could be reacting to any, any one of these comp components on this sheet you could be reacting to. And you could have a gluten sensitivity to any one of those. But traditional testing only looks at alpha gliadin and transglutaminase. That's it. If you go over to the part with lectins that breaks down into wheat germ agglutinin, that is one that is found more in sprouted grains. For people that have severe reactions to gluten, that is the most severe. Most of the time they're actually reacting to that. But it's never tested. 